today we're going to have a look at uh, little monkey apps. Uh, missing numbers. So we've got subtractions, addition, uh, subtraction, addition, how many show me and our teaching tool down there. Um, and of course our teaching hints. Let's have a little quick look. Alright, so missing numbers is about problem solving within addition and subtraction. So there's one, two, three, four sections and the teacher tool. Um, I won't read that to you because I'll explain as I go through. Um, Alright, let's have a look at first of all at show me. I know I seem to be doing things backwards, but you'll understand. So, um, sounds a little bit um, soft. But it basically reads what's up there. Move two balls into the box to show six minus two. I want to hear it again to compress that. So all this is asking is to move the objects, which is important in subtraction because you are moving. Um, and then you can check it. Oh, I got one. So it's not even asking for an answer. It's just asking you to move. Um, Two. Okay, so this quickly um, becomes stagnant, but you could um, ask your students to get to 10. If you get it wrong, okay, now I'll get it right. Okay, so it tells you that you're correct, but you don't get any scores. Back to home. Alright, let's have a look at how many, how many are all together. Alright, so it's asking you 4 plus 2. So the hand is like this at the moment, open her palm. Looks remarkably similar, doesn't it? Um, to get the answer. Um, okay, 6. Some students may... Some students may count from 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, although I re recognise that that's 6. And that's three, so six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Correct. How many altogether? Okay, so swap the hand to that side. Um, just to make something different. You'll notice that they're all the same sizes. You're not asking apples plus oranges, you're asking marbles plus marbles. Alright, so let's go back home. Alright, so that was show me and how many. Now let's have a look at um, subtraction. Alright, so this is why I showed you that other one before, because you're moving away. How many have you moved away so that there are five left? Now, this is where problem com solving comes in. Um, you could say five plus something equals eight. Well, this is your something. One, two, three, four, five. Some students may work that way and they go six, seven, eight. So actually count one to one or they might count um, forwards five and then six seven eight or they might say eight seven six five four three so they might count forwards or they might count backwards you'll notice that the box opens and it's been corrected now if they're really stuck they can sneak peek um, and of course Still get the answer correct. Um, what you're aiming for is that they don't need to sneak a peek. But some students may need to actually peek. Okay, so just changing it there. Seven take away something equals two. Some might say, I don't know. How am I supposed to know? Um, I often used to do this in the classroom with cups. Um, or jelly beans, sometimes that uh, jelly beans um, makes them concentrate more uh, because they know at the end they're going to get a jelly bean. So seven, six, five, um, or they might count uh, one, two, and then three, four, five, six, seven. I've got five fingers, so and five, and of course checking. You'll know which way is right for your students. All right, so addition, same thing. Uh, but with addition. Well, we know there's four. Well done. There are 12 altogether. How 
Right, so I can sneak a peek and I can still get it wrong. Alright, so it went green, moves on to the next equation. Um, if you're doing this in the classroom, you might even um, make a list of fact families. So 2 plus 8, we know it's 2. 2 plus 8 equals 10. 10 take away 2 equals 8. 10 take away 8 equals 2. Um, so that um, you're building that knowledge. Right back to home. Alright, let's have a quick look at teaching tool. Teaching tool is a box which you can close or open. Um, one of the things that I might do with this is say the answer using a pencil equals um, everyone I want you to make it equal five. You can come up with anything you want. Um, so you could have two, or let's say three, and then plus five, and then the student has to write in um, three plus something equals five, then pass it to the partner. Um, next to them, um, who then has to say the answer is 2. Okay, let's check. Oops, turn off the pencil. Um, it's 2. Um, you can, of course, use the balls. Only 2, not too much choice there, but that's okay. Um, reset, coloured pencils. Uh, if they come up with a really good one, that they really like, um, they can take a photo of it, the screen has been saved to the photo gallery, or they can email it. Um, now it's from, oh, didn't really want to send that, let's cancel that, <laughs> delete draft. Um, really useful for um, record keeping. So there is uh, Little Monkey Apps. Missing numbers.